drop a like and sub in the next 5 seconds and this will be your Fortnite account. If you don't, this will be your account. Fortnite Mirrors 2022 will be releasing in just one week's time and obviously going to be bringing us all brand new free rewards that we will be able to get in game. Well in today's video we're going to be going over a brand new free skin bundle that you guys will be able to get here inside of Fortnite Season 4. But trust me you want to make sure you're staying tuned to the very end of this video so you don't want to miss any of this. But just quickly 75% of you guys are not subscribed which means you are missing out on a chance for a free gift inside of the Fortnite item shop as we do get 5 new and all subscribers every single day inside of it. Well, well today we do have the addition of the brand new Agency Renegades pack which honestly is super cool as it comes with 3 skins, 3 backlinks and also 3 harvesting tools. If any of you guys are going to be in need of a gift all you have to do is drop a like on this video make sure you are subscribed to the channel with the post notification bell turned on. Most importantly make sure to drop a comment down below with your epic games ID, what item from the item shop you would like to have gifted to you on your account. And just like always there is a secret word hidden in this video which will give you an even better chance of receiving a gift from me so make sure you keep your eyes out for it. If you have to pick up anything inside of the item shop for yourself do consider using my support credit code YTORA as it greatly supports the channel and it allows me to do even more giveaways for you guys hashtag ad. and with all of that being said let's get straight into today's video so first of all we did actually just get the release of the brand new explosive goo gun available in Fortnite right now which is actually a super cool and unique weapon alongside with the addition of the brand new throwable launch pads which is actually kind of weird that they changed the launch pads in this way now they do actually take up a slot in your inventory Definitely would give the explosive Google a go, considering it actually is a super fun weapon to use in game. When it does come to brand new free bundles available in game, we actually have quite a few of them. But with the latest update that we did receive in Fortnite, we actually had the addition of two brand new skins, which were actually in the game for quite some time now. The very first one being the Order Remnant skin, which more or less is an IO Guard skin that will be coming to the game. Also, the addition of the brand new Svenja skin, which obviously was a seven henchman that was on the map last season well they have both received tags to obviously be available to come to the game in the form of brand new skins and it does look like this actually will be a brand new upcoming bundle you guys should be able to get for free in the near future and also considering we are getting the four nightmares event next week which obviously is going to be adding tons of brand new challenges then obviously give us all brand new four nightmares team rewards such as backlinks pickaxes and everything else of the sort you can definitely see these skins being potentially unlocked by completing every single one of the upcoming four nightmares challenges when we do get the release of them with the 22.20 update. So obviously we'll be releasing on the 18th of October considering we did see that from the official Fortnite Mirrors teaser. Well I do think it's about time that we are able to unlock the brand new official IO Guard skin considering we have actually had them on the Fortnite map ever since chapter 2 season 5. There is also another 7 related skin as well that could potentially be a part of this bundle which is obviously the Savan skin. It's still currently sitting inside of the game files but when it did actually come to these 7 related skins they actually had tons of different edit styles to change the colors of them. It's definitely pretty cool so you will actually be able to change the skin to whatever color you would like once you unlock it. I am curious, be sure to let me know down in the comments which skin do you prefer, the Order Remnant or the Svenja skin. But also keep in mind that we still actually have quite the amount of other free skins that you can actually get in Fortnite right now such as the fact that the Refer Friend 2.0 is still ongoing. It will unlock you the entire set for the Xandar skin which obviously comes with a skin, a backling, harvesting tool and weapon ramp. We would try and work on those challenges if you obviously still can and have a friend to reboot. Also, with some recent leaks, it actually does look like we're going to be seeing a lot of brand new skin bundles arriving in the game soon. It was leaked that Fortnite are actually planning another collaboration with Star Wars, which is actually going to bring the addition of Luke Skywalker. Firstly, makes sense considering you can actually see Luke Skywalker in the cinematic trailer for Season 4. Right behind the scientist, we can see a back to tank from Star Wars, an unknown character sitting inside of it, which is very similar to what we did see in the Empire Strikes Back movie, where Luke Skywalker was actually inside one of the these tanks. That's not all as it does look like we're going to be seeing the addition of two brand new mythic lightsabers, one of them being the green lightsaber and one of them being the blue lightsaber, specifically for Luke Skywalker. This event starts there's going to be all brand new challenges that will be available in game as well that will actually be able to unlock you some brand new rewards. I personally hope are a lot better than the ones that we did get for the May the 4th event considering I'm pretty sure all we got for that one was actually a banner. Who knows maybe when this collaboration actually starts we could actually be seeing the addition of the brand new lightsaber harvesting tool. Now people have been patiently waiting for that harvesting tool to arrive in game considering we've even had Darth Vader as a tier 100 and he did have a space spoon as a harvesting tool. There's also another free skin that you guys can actually get in game right now if you do actually go ahead and pre-order the Goat Simulator 3 game. Well the Goat Simulator games are normally pretty fun anyway so I would actually
actually try this out if you can access it. If you do pre-order, you will actually be unlocking the A Goat skin, which you can see up on screen is definitely a little bit cursed for Fortnite. You will be able to run into lobbies and obviously flex out the skin before it releases in the item shop in late November. Well, when it does come to an all brand new skin bundle, which I'm pretty sure every single one of you guys is most excited for, which is actually going to be the brand new Anime Legends pack. You do see a pack like this every single year, which normally you can actually buy in store and actually redeem a code for it. Well, this year we're actually going to be getting the Anime Legends pack, which will be available on the 21st of October in just 10 days time. In this brand new pack, you will be getting three brand new skins, one of them being the Anime Midas, Ready Penny skin, and also the Ricochet Rocks outfit. You will be getting their back blings, harvesting tools, and also a brand new email with this pack, which I will be giving away tons of codes for this brand new bundle once it obviously releases. Be sure to let me know down in the comments if you guys are going to be needing the brand new Anime Legends pack, because I definitely think it is a super cool one. And well, not only that, it does look like we're also going to be seeing the addition of an upcoming Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse collab here inside of Season 4 as well. It was a movie that was actually originally supposed to be releasing on the 7th of October, but it was released until June of 2023. Collaboration here inside of Fortnite is obviously still going ahead right now, considering we do actually have Spider-Gwen from that movie as the Tier 100 outfit here inside of Season 4. It was confirmed by Hypex himself that we will be seeing Miles Morales arrive in the game later in the season. Hypex did actually post this, saying Fortnite X Spider-Verse Gwen is in the Season 4 Battle Pass, which means Miles Morales comes later in the item shop. Gotten confirmation for this from multiple reliable people and mid Rado got confirmation from his side too. Spider-Man Miles Morales will finally be making his appearance inside of Fortnite considering we've had tons of teasers about him from the very start of Chapter 3. That's how we did even have his uncle as the secret skin inside of Chapter 3 Season 2 with him being obviously the Prowler. Not only that, for any of you guys who do play on PlayStation, there may actually be an exclusive reward for all of you guys as well. Considering these PlayStation exclusive Spider-Man Miles Morales game will actually be moving over to the Epic Games Store in the next upcoming months. Once this happens, obviously any of you guys who play on PC will be able to play this game, which is actually a super fun game, I would not recommend it enough. But if any of you guys actually do play on a PlayStation, if you do log on while actually owning the Spider-Man outfit, there is a chance that you could actually be getting this as a bonus edit style, which you can see is the suit from that game. It does look like a more realistic version of Miles Morales, which I definitely think would be a super fun way of obviously giving this to PlayStation users only. That's how with the latest update they've actually gone ahead and reworked the mythic web shooters It looks like they also will be making a return at some point as well And most likely getting some sort of recolor to obviously fit Miles Morales and spider Gwen Which could even lead to them actually adding more abilities in them seeing as Miles Morales can actually go invisible Still not confirmed on when exactly this collaboration will be arriving in the game But be sure to let me know down in the comments Are you guys excited for the Across the Spider-Verse collab here inside of Fortnite Season 4? Well possibly one of the best ways to get yourself a free bundle here in season 4 is actually going to be the Fortnite Zero War comic book rewards. Now you don't actually need to buy the comic books in order to get all the codes for this as all of the comics are available on Marvel Unlimited. If you are looking to get each and every single one of these rewards for absolutely free, what I would recommend you guys do is actually create yourself an account and then go ahead and start your one month free trial. By doing so you actually will be able to read all 5 of the comic books which will give you all 5 of the rewards. It will give you the Spider-Man Zero skin alongside with his back bling. The Stark 7 Weapon Wrap, the Adamantium Claws Pickaxe, Snick Snick Spray, the Zero War Loading Screen, and you also will be getting the bonus outfit which you can get for redeeming all 5 codes. Obviously is being the Iron Man Zero outfit, which is definitely pretty cool as it comes with a harvesting tool, lots of different edit styles, a built in emo, and much much more. That honestly is one of the best ways to get yourself a free skin bundle here inside of Season 4, considering it costs nothing at all and you will be getting 2 skins along with tons of other cosmetics. Well, it looks like we may have actually gotten our very first look at one of the upcoming Fort Nightmares rewards that we will be able to unlock once that update goes live. Which is going to be the brand new It's a Wash Emo, which you can see up on screen, definitely looks pretty cool. Being as how we don't know what any of the upcoming challenges will be, we have no idea how exactly we will be able to unlock this brand new emo. I will make sure I keep you guys updated on any more information we do get about brand new free skins and more here inside of Fortnite Season 4. But unfortunately, that is all I pretty much have for you guys in today's video. For the secret word of today, this video it is going to be the word seven if you did watch all the way to the very end of this video make sure to drop that word down in the comments alongside with your epic games id and if you did enjoy the video make sure to drop a like on it subscribe to the channel if you're new and i'll talk to you all in the next one peace